Hey everyone, it's Darren from Dell. Thanks so much for taking the time to tune in. I am pumped. Today we are going to be taking a look at the Latitude 7455. This is a Qualcomm Snapdragon product. One of our brand new Copilot Plus PCs. I feel like a kid at the candy store. We're going to open it up, take a first look. Can't wait to jump in. Uh, if you are aware, Qualcomm Snapdragon CPUs uh, have come to market and Dell did launch five new Copilot Plus PCs at Dell Tech World. We have two Inspiron devices, one XPS Plus, so that's a total of three consumer devices. And we have this one, which is our Latitude 7455. And then later this year, we'll have another Latitude 5000 series product come to market. Uh, this the Qualcomm Snapdragon uh, chipset is really exciting. This year, we've been talking a lot about the neural processing unit, giving you better performance, greater battery life because of this low power dedicated AI engine. With regards to the Qualcomm Snapdragon, you are gonna see the Orion CPU, Adreno GPU, and the Hexagon neural processing unit that is gonna give you 45 tops, which is fantastic. And because of that, as I mentioned, this Latitude 7455 will hit Microsoft's Copilot Plus PC spec because you need an MPU of at least 40 tops. Let's jump in. So let's go ahead and cut the seal <laughs> again. So pumped. Uh, so with regards to the Latitude 7455, uh, this is going to have the Qualcomm Snapdragon up to 12 core uh, CPU. You are going to see up to 32 gigs of memory, up to a terabyte of storage, all that good stuff that comes to life. I love the packaging. You know, this can go directly in the recycling bin. Love the approach to sustainability here. So popping the cover off, I cannot wait. You are presented with... The device, holy moly, this is super light. Place that down there. Warranty, safety, regulatory information. Place this aside. Over here, the AC adapter. Gotta love how small these adapters have come. This is a 65 watt adapter. And pretty much, that's it. This is the unboxing of this 7455. Holy. Wow. This thing is so incredibly thin. I don't think we've had any latitude like this. Wow. Gotta love the, the logo there from a Qualcomm Snapdragon perspective. Speakers, again, top firing. You got quad speaker assembly. You're gonna see to the QHD resolution. This is gonna be 16 by 10 from an aspect ratio perspective. Gotta love the, the co-pilot key right there. A lot of innovation has gone into this. Precision click pad, really, really smooth. Power button over here. Let's take a look at the ports. So you do have two USB type C. It's gonna be the indicator light. You do have your micro SD slot. And if I flip it around, good old headset jack and our lovely USB type A. Gotta love that they've kept that. Let's get this powered up and take a first look at Windows on ARM. Can't wait. So recall was one of the controversial things from a security perspective, uh, but it has moved to Windows Insider program uh, preview to do some additional testing whatnot before it goes out to the masses. Uh, but uh, glad to see that uh, the situation here is continuing to evolve. Finishing the setup, gotta love it, Qualcomm Snapdragon X Plus.
So I've got my Qualcomm Snapdragon Latitude 7455 initialized. You will see that I do have the Qualcomm Orion CPU, which is the X Plus 10 core version. I've got 16 gigs of memory installed. I can go all the way up to 32. 512 gigabit SSD, uh, which is great for Copilot Plus in the future of recall and, and things like that. I've got, you know, a Wi-Fi 7 uh, Qualcomm card here. And then the NPU, which is the Qualcomm Hexagon NPU. Uh, this is your dedicated low power AI engine uh, where you can offload things like Windows Studio effects, the NPU will light up and background blur and things like that. You can use live caption, some of the other cool features that uh, Microsoft brings to life with regards to Copilot Plus PCs. So we're going to try getting the NPU to wake up and we're going to try Microsoft Paint and use the co-creator functionality. So let's click on co-creator. Let's add my drawing. And now let's go turtle swimming in the ocean. Let's see, the NPU is going to wake up. And what is that? Oh, wow. So it took that baseline drawing and converted that using generative AI and you saw the NPU woke up. So pretty cool in terms of some of the functionality that you have with the new Copilot Plus PCs. And that picture just got even better and it continues to evolve with more iterations. So this is really cool in terms of what you can do with generative AI, Microsoft Copilot Plus PCs. So here's another test of the NPU and using live captions. So the NPU is, you know, active, listening to, to what I'm saying and things like that. So let's see if we can get uh, live captions going testing one two three so up at the top you do see the live captions are working the NPU is using about 10 percent utilization uh, this is pretty cool uh, this is again a feature of Microsoft Copilot plus PCs using the live caption functionality so if I were to bring up Dell Optimizer and quickly show you that experience there you will see it looks a little bit different from the traditional uh, windows you know non-arm version you will have an application section where i can prioritize foreground applications i will have a power option where i can look at battery health in terms of what's going on from a battery perspective but also thermal management are user selectable thermal tables do i want to ship this in an optimized mode uh, which is how dell does do i want to put it in a cool mode which is basically going to lower some of the surface temperatures there do i want it in a quiet mode to decrease fan noise or do I just care about performance and you know you will have higher surface temperatures more fan noise and things like that by default Dell will ship in the optimized mode uh, which is great to see but with that this is the quick little first look at the latitude 7455 hope you enjoyed it thank you so much for tuning in take care